out of chapter 4 of annex 14 of circulation surfaces we have already discussed first three surfaces moving on to the fourth surface that is approach surface which is defined as an inclined plane or combination of planes preceding the threshold a top view of approach surfaces for both the runways would somehow look like this since you can see there are three different colors these three different color codings are for three different planes making up the approach surface zooming in for one runway we can see the first plane starts from the strip of runway that is 60 meters from runway threshold and it has a length of 3000 meters the second surface connected to the first one has a length of 3600 meters and the third surface that is connected with the second one has a length of 8400 meters overall if you add them all the three surfaces will add up to 15 kilometers that is the limitation of obstacle limitation surfaces zooming in further we can see the distance between runway threshold and the starting of approach surface is 60 meters since that part is counted as runway strip and the starting of approach surface that is innermost edge of the approach surface would have a length of 280 meters with a divergence of 15 percent slope on both sides if you take a look onto the profile view of these surfaces the innermost surface would have a slope of two percent from runway till 3000 meters then the second surface has a slope of 2.5 percent for 3600 meters and the third surface has a slope of 0% that is no slope till the end of obstacle limitation surface. In the given picture this blue color surface is approach surface. I hope everything was clear. Thank you.